I'm starving. We stopped for food 20 minutes ago. You call that food? Come on, Ben. Can't you try to appreciate the unique culture around you? Your cousin is right, Ben. I mean, who knows when we'll get to have freshly roasted liverwurst again. Maybe a cheeseburger doesn't sound so bad. Uh, Grandpa, did you forget what side of the road to drive on again? Oops. <laughs> Thank you, Gwen. Hey, I'll have this down by the end of our European adventure. Whoa! What was that flash? Mm, probably just lightning. There's not a cloud in the sky. Let's go check it out. Better not be another incredible historical land. It came from this way. What is that? Hicks. Ben Tennyson? Here to foil my brilliant plan. Let's see how you do without the help of your ridiculous aliens. What did you do? Feeling outmatched. Imagine how you'll feel when I found the other three power crystals. With their energy combined, I shall be unstoppable. You won't get away with this, Hex! Ben! Are you okay? I'm fine. But my aliens! That crystal is no joke if it was able to damage the Omnitrix. Hex must have dropped this. I've never seen inscriptions like this before. Maybe it has some clues about those crystals he mentioned. on? Did a tree fall? Should I get my first aid kit? We just had a pretty close call, but everyone is fine. Good, good, good. I'm, uh, I'm Ryan, park ranger of Grisenball Forest. Uh, would you be willing to make a statement about this incident? Sure, quit. Maybe you could check out that tablet back at the rust bucket while I give the state good plan. Um, excellent. Meet me at my cabin when you're ready. I'll be ready to take down your account of the incident in just a moment. As you can see, there's quite a panic among the forest critters. My critter radar, I call it the Cradar, <laughs> shows animals uh, fleeing the park. Maybe I can help calm them down? Good. Uh, could you take this cassette tape to the radio tower? The soothing sound of smooth jazz should do the trick. Huh, okay. Just one thing. What's a cassette tape? Oh boy. Ah, well, maybe our other volunteer will know. Kevin, come meet Ben. Kevin? Oh, you know one another. Excellent. We know each other, all right. Listen, Ben, I know we haven't always been the best at working together, but Hex and his crystal might be a little more than you can handle. How do you know? Whenever you mess things up and need my help, I'll be around to lend a hand. Or... Nailed it! Uh-oh. That's a problem for later. First, I have to get to the radio tower. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's a BBQ'd monster for dinner. Excellent work, Ben. It should calm the nerves in the park. It all went smoothly, except that tree that fell right behind me. Oh, it's been happening all over the park. I can help with that. Oh, well, okay. Um, there's a saw in the shed out back. Oh, I won't be needing that. I've got the ultimate firepower. Please, hold the applause. Good to see you, Ben. I was getting nervous and was about to come check on you. Don't worry. I got to the root of the problem. Excellent. Well, let's head inside it. Oh, my keys. That blasted bird nests nearby every year and will steal anything shiny for her nest. Hang tight. 
I'll have your keys in no time. Heroes always come out on top. Doubted you. Maybe you could look into this call I just received. There's some rogue wildlife harassing park goers in the picnic area. Leave it to me. Those bandits won't be stealing any more picnic baskets. Ben Tennyson saves the day again. Thank goodness you scared away those, well, whatever they were. Now, if only someone would stop blasting that music, we could get back to our date. Hey, you seem pretty good at conflict resolution. Maybe you could ask them to keep it down. You'd be a hero. Are we forgetting I just defeated a horde of vicious monsters? Fine. Omnitrix? How? <laughs> Through simple sonic manipulation, a world-class DJ like... Bend all the notes you want. I can still stop you. This is my end of the world tour. I'll be bringing down the house all over. Anyone who doesn't pay up will get a very special bass drop. Prepare to be cancelled, Decibel.
of the mood in this venue, but this was just the opening act. I better keep an ear out for Lord Decibel's concerts. He won't be jamming once I show up. First, I need to find Ranger Ryan and tell him about those raccoons I found. Ben, we've been searching everywhere for you. We've got bigger problems than raccoons. Uh, you can say that again. The picnic area was infested with actual monsters. <sighs> and I thought Strudelbeck would be a relaxing, peaceful place to be a part ranger. Hi, I am Stefan. Nice to meet you, Ben. Ranger Ryan has told me you've proven to be very helpful here in the park. I've heard reports of strange activity in a few areas. Uh, why don't you open your map and look? One of the locations is Grashugal Village, where I am mayor, and I could really use your help around town. You need to investigate one of the three locations. I'll keep the park under control. Thanks, Ranger Ryan. I'll do my best to get to the bottom of this. Tubular! Find anything on that tablet? I've just started to decode the inscriptions, but I think it definitely mentions the crypt. That's not why I called, though. Grandpa said he could use your hub at the rest bucket. I'll be right there. Hiya, Ben. Seems like the rust bucket broke down between a rock and a hard place. While I get us out of this pickle, I could use your help getting a fire started so we can grill some grub. You made this sound important. No problem, Grandpa. Oh, I saw some good firewood around the park. Look at that fire. So, what'll it be, Gwen? Uh, hot dogs or hamburgers? Both. We'll save some for you too, Ben. Now that the rust bucket's back in order, I can give you a lift so you can save the world even faster. <laughs> and I'll hold on to any cool stuff you find around Strudelbeck. Looks like I have a big adventure ahead of me. Now, where should I go first? Ben 10 Power Trip. Monsters, this is getting unfair. Thank you. 
monster! Kiddo, I'm Carla Clams. The shop, I see you've got some coins you're just itching to spend. Take a look at my shop. I'm sure you'll find something to buy. I got lots of good stuff. To see you again, Ben. I hope you're still up to get things back in order. Sure. Are you okay, though? Oh, don't worry about me. I am the Burgermeister, after all. No way! Burgermeister? I'm starving! Uh, Burgermeister is our word for mayor. Oh, I guess that's cool, too. So what's wrong with you? This incident has jeopardized the Lumberjack Festival! What happened? Our landscapers were inexplicably scared away mid-raking. Now there are piles of leaves all over town. I'd be eternally grateful if you would pick up where they left off, Ben. Leave it to me, Mr. Mayor. How does it look? I'll go out on a limb and say the town looks great. Excellent! Thanks, Ben! We've been having some issues with the power in town. That's something I can fix in no time. I'm pretty good with electricity for a tenure. Oh, how kind of you! Uh, if you follow the power lines out of town, you should find the Transformers.
really looking forward to the weekend, you guys.
Thank you, Ben. Now I can read my... So, what else can I do to help? Grashugal has always had a world-class lumberjack team. But this year, as embarrassing as it is, our team has showed up beardless. Lumberjacks without beards? Lumberjacks without beards. Our last hope is Dr. Fibian, the local scientist. She may be able to whip something up that will get some whiskers on our team in time for the festival. A scientist? Cool! Be back soon! Uh, by the way, there are civilians around town that could probably use your help. I hope you wouldn't mind looking into them. You got it, Mayor. <laughs> I like shorts. Radical! Comfy and easy to wear. This will definitely help.
found all the items you need. Let's see. Ten millimeters of molecules, ten millimeters, twenty grams of flammo. Up in here you are, Ben. The beard growth serum should have those baby faces looking like a team of Sasquatches in no time. Thanks, Dr. Fibian. I'll take this to the Lumberjacks right away. All right! Check out my cool scooter tricks! You must be Ben. Major Stefan told us you were coming. Right, huh? You're all looking kind of lumberjack-ish. I just wait. Let's get those beards on. It worked. Those beards look totally normal. Thanks. We're going to get back to work preparing for the festival. Throttleback is the greatest. Ben, good to see you again. Thank you again for helping with the lumberjacks. Dr. Fibian saves the day once again. No problem. So what do you need my help with? Faba Abernathy's carrots ripened today, and he has got no one to help pick them. Hmm. Are you sure these are the most important tasks to be doing when there's a supernatural force on the loose? Clearly you have never had a fresh pink carrot from Faba Abernathy. Anyway, as Burgermeister, I think I know what the most important... Uh, all right, if you say so. At least it isn't broccoli. Ow! 
Thank you, laddie. I was sure I was done for. How's out picking me carrots? Oh, gosh, me carrot! Oh, well, now I won't have to bother with picking them. Uh, I'd better get going. I'm helping prepare for the Lumberjack Festival. Oh, uh, before you head off, there's been a strange sound coming from your bar. I'm afraid. Uh, why is it always monsters? Fine, I'll take a look. I've got a fireball with your name on it! Ow! is back in action and ready to lend a hand. Or four. <clears throat> Knocking it for chumps. Time for some action. Yeah. <laughs> 
Be more careful from now on. This village one step close. Thanks, but Farmer Abernathy's carrot field was destroyed when I got there. What? Oh, this will raise my spirits. Ben, meet the Grashugal Lumberjack team. Hello, Ben. Is everything set up for the festival then? Well, we've had some trouble getting the big logs out of the lumber yard. Yeah, we're stumped. I'm sure Ben here will handle it. Uh, can't you, Ben? Well, hanging out with lumberjacks does sound fun. Meet us at the lumber yard when you're ready. I can see my house from here. This will make me stronger. <laughs> Getting in my daily reps. Everything with me. You're 
You're outnumbered. Four arms to two. Out of my way! coming. See you, Ben. All we need to do is get these logs out of the lumber yard so they can be hauled to the festival site. I'll take a swing at it. One more for me? Nice job. We knew there was a reason. You can chop that up as a success. Ha! <laughs> You're all right, kid. Want to come practice chop? You don't have to ax me twice. That sounds like a blast. Great. Come meet us in the woods when you want to start.
Okay, Ben. We've marked some trees for you. Let's see what you've got. Get ready for launch! Coming through! Knocking into the chumps! Coming through! Out of my way! Prepare for impact! You're practically a pro lumberjack, Ben! We found this massive tree and we thought we'd give you the honor of chopping it! Try to chop him down? Not like that. Good thing you were here, Ben. I hate to admit it, but we were quivering like saplings. Don't worry about it. I should probably check in with Gwen. Hey, Gwen, what's up? Hey, Ben, how's it going? I got to hang out with lumberjacks, but I also found a magical tree that spawned void monsters when I tried to chop it down. Huh. I wonder if that's one of the power springs the tablet mentions. There are three locations. And it says they'll all be in normal places no one would suspect. A tree in the forest fits that description. You're right. I'd better go call the mayor. Bye, Ben. Oh, and bring me a souvenir from... No taking me down now. I took care of the trees, but now I have to tell you about the magical monsters around town. One of our lumberjacks just stopped by to tell us what happened in the forest. I'm sure that sneaky sorcerer Hex had something to do with this. Yes, well, I've asked Dr. Fibian to help investigate what could have caused such a reaction. You can find her lab in the swamp. I'm 
a scooter commuter. to the slimy little guys right here. <laughs> now for the fun part. We just need that slime. So the frogs won't be hurt at all. Ready to help? Oh yeah. This is nothing. See what happens. Take it away, Doc. 
Yes! <laughs> Wait a minute. That's one of the crystals Hex was searching for. It certainly is. Most excellent work, Dr. Anne. And using Ben as your lab assistant. Truly genius. Let's get out of here. Oh, and Ben, I have a parting gift for you as a thank you for your help. Amphibian? I should have known she'd be slimy. Whoa! I'm gonna go out on a limb and guess this guy isn't on my side. I guessed right. Bring it on, Frankenpot! now, but that was no joke. Hex isn't messing around with those crystals. Lucky me! Hey 
there, kid. I'm Ariel Roman, reporter for the Strudelbeck Times. Wait a minute. Are you Ben 10? Uh, yeah, that's me. But how did you know? Stefan told me about all the good you've been doing around Strudelbeck. Oh, uh, it's no big deal. Unless you want to put me in the paper. In that case, it was pretty brave. I could use someone with your, uh, talents. A strange smell from the factory's got me worried. Could you go take a look? There may be a real story there. You'd put me on the front page? The featured story. Get down there, kid! Hey, kiddo. I'm Carla Clams. The shop, I see you. Take a look. Kiddo. shower in that water and it's going right into the river ariel will definitely want to hear about this hey what are you doing in here there are monsters on the loose monsters are my specialty oh really well uh we can use your head I i'd say go for it kid first we need to get inside that control room but the generator switches are being guarded by the monsters don't worry my monster fighting skills are way above satisfactory
I've got a fireball with your name on it. Another voice. It's time for a rumble. Take that. Piglin, what's up? 
what you find. You were right. The factory's on lockdown and dumping waste into the river. Huh. Now that is a story. I'll continue looking into it with my sources. I need to eat more vegetables. Piglin, what's up? Hey, Ben. I think I've got a corner of the tablet figured out. Awesome. What does it say? It looks like an old map of the city with landmarks. I'll send the locations of the landmarks to you to investigate. Great idea. And I bet I can see everything from the rooftops. Just be careful. coming.
need that. No time. All the locations on my map. Maybe I should show these to Ariel. Maybe you should investigate there. Thanks for the scoop, Ariel. Door. I bet there's something cool in there. hoping for but there's clearly something weird going on here and I better that he should be taking our findings seriously. She's right. Monsters from another dimension have made it into the city. Monsters? Can you prove this? Yes. I was coming to tell Ariel about a secret doorway with mysterious symbols, right in town square. <sighs> okay. Uh, take me there. What? No way! 
Where'd the door go? Good kid. I don't know what you are playing yet, but I have real work to get to. Hex! I should have known he'd be here. I'd better chase him down. Shock Rock is charged up and ready to give Hex the shock of his life. Ugh. I'm ready for battle. Monsters? Let's see if I can find a way out. 
Nice! Monsters, over there! Wait, thanks for the tipper. No problem. I think your friend Ariel is in a sticky situation, though. That officer brought her down to the police station for questioning. Uh-oh, I'll see what I can do. Five minutes! I'm ready for battle. We only talk to people we know, or people who prove themselves to us. Fine, whatever. I can prove myself. What do you want me to do? We have a band. If you can get our album on the radio, we'd let you hang with us. I'm on it!
monsters nearby. So cool, man. You can hang with us, dude. All right. What's that note you got there? Uh, we know everything about the mediums of. Okay, so where can I find them? Uh, in the mediums of my comic books. They aren't real. Yeah, they're a group of three magicians who team up to forge four magical crystals. Uh, I'm not so sure these are just comic book characters. The comic follows their whole saga. The last issue comes out. I bet that would tell me how their evil plan ended. I'll go check to see if the comic book shop has it in yet. Right on, Ben. Bring it right back to us if you get a copy. <laughs> You and everybody else in Strudelbeck City. I'm very sorry, kid. We're s the delivery truck just left, though. Maybe you could convince the driver to uh, sneak you a copy. Worth a try. Check out my cool scooter tricks. Get the ocean starting time for me next to the Hey there, need some backup? Please!
respect that. Thanks. My pleasure, sir. But in return, maybe you could give me just one copy of the latest issue of... Sure thing, kid. Here you go. are preparing to use the crystals for some kind of spell. Let me see. Oh, look. They're finally going to take over the world. All right. And then a little boy shows up. He's nice to them. The magicians realize their spell would punish the people who would love and appreciate them given the chance. So they hide the power crystals throughout their country, hoping no one ever finds them again. Sad yip. There's the tablet Gwen found, too. Looks like they wrote a bunch of their secrets there. If someone did find the crystals again, they could use them to do some real damage. I'm one step closer to understanding what happened here. I mean, in the comic. I should let Ariel in on what I found here. An upgrade a day keeps the doctor away. Hey, kid. Ben, my story is hot off the presses and ready to be delivered. You should take a look at the front page. Oh yeah, I'm famous! These papers just need to be out the door before... Oh no, my editor will be here in just a few minutes. Do you think you could help me deliver them? Leave it to me. Thank you. 
couldn't catch me even with that silly alien of yours. I'm ready for battle. crew. I bet if this happened in Strudelbeck City, everyone would have gotten a day off from school. Then I'd be a real hero. This'll make me stronger! Last night. 
right. I know someone whose skills would be a good match for this. Hold tight. Thank you. Stefan called me and told me a fine young man would be coming to help. That's me, Ben Tennyson, here to help. Oh, good. There's some weird stuff going on in town. My dear friend Bunny called in a panic. Something about uh, monsters? Monsters? I can handle that. Oh, she's up at the ski lodge. Please hurry. I'm on it. Welcome to the that stranger. Marie told me you could use some help. Oh, thank goodness. I'm Bunny Hill, manager of the Iceberg Lodge and retired professional skier. No way! But I'm not as young as I once was. My nephew is professional snowboard of Francois Lecroix. No way! Yes, yes, but listen. He was taken captive by strange monsters at the top of the mountain. I would go myself. But the ski lift is down. I can take care of that. Snow problem. The gate to the mountain is locked. Take the ski car to get through, please. Hop. Leave it to me, ma'am. This is getting too weird for me.
my way. An upgrade a day keeps the doctor away. Too hot to handle. some help. Oui, monsieur, I am trapped.
for your help, monsieur. No problem. I'm your biggest fan. Ah, merci. But I'm afraid I twisted my ankle. Perhaps you could uh, get this key lift running so I can head down and tell my auntie I am okay. The pieces must be hiding somewhere on this mountain. I get this key lift running so I can add back. The pieces must be hiding some. Monsters! I see monsters! Feel the wrath of wrath! A 
Excellent work, our son. I'm sure Aunt Bonnie would like to thank you herself. See you at the bottom. Take that! sick about my poor nephew. No problem. I came to Iceberg to get to the bottom of the supernatural activity happening in Strudelbeck. Do you, hmm, a boy with such serious questions should go see our fortune teller Astrid. Here, tag this bracelet and tell her you're a friend. Well, it's worth a try. Another day saved. This'll make me stronger. Come back to this later. Hello. I've been expecting you. Uh, cool. I'm looking for answers. Aren't we all? I guess. There's this evil magician, Hex, and he's up to something horrible that's causing chaos all over Strudelbeck. I need to know where he's hiding so I can stop him. Ah, yes. I see. The universe has sent a message for you. Follow the path of fire to the mouth with no tongue. There is what you seek. Huh? What does that mean? That is for you to discover. I am a messenger for the universe, not a translator. Penguin, what's up? Hey, Ben. Learn anything new about our spooky sorcerer? Maybe. A fortune teller gave me this strange riddle. She said, follow the path of fire to the mouth with no tongue. Any ideas? Hmm. According to my research, there's an old road where the people of Strudelbeck would light torches. Maybe check it out. Torches. Ro Good luck, Ben. And be...
Mouth of the cave! Gee, I hope there's no tongues in here. Nothing to do with Hexa. I should tell Astrid what I found here. Aha! Add that to my list of accomplishments. I'll get it right next time. I found something cool in the cave, but no answers. Hmm. Let us try again. Yay, more of this. Oh. Oh. Destiny awaits on top of Spaghetti Mountain. Now that makes some sense. I've definitely seen that on my map. Check out my cool scooter tricks. Take that! Come in handy. Thank you. 
I see monsters! I'm gonna head back to Astrid and give this last one a try. This will definitely... I sense you may feel some frustration, but I must thank you for finding my lost kitty. Um, the fate of all Strudelbeck is hanging in the balance here! Hmm, yes. I sense the universe has one fi- I see numbers. Two, three, seven, and a horse of great length. I'll take care of this. Back and ready to dish out the Diamond Head Special, a 24 karat beatdown. Uh, let's try that again. Monsters. I'm sliding on in. Just getting by.
baddies up ahead. to the universe must have attracted dark energy. Hopefully my fortune was worth your effort. Aw, oh, come on! That fortune was ridiculous! A horse of great length? I think I'll just try finding Hex on my own. Wait a minute. A horse of great length? Astrid was talking about the Long Horse Inn! And the number two... I wonder what I'd find there. I should... Take that! Where I am right now. Hex 
Max's hotel room. What? See if you can find anything interesting. I should bring this to Astrid. I bet she can help me figure out where this map points. The day is not saved yet. Ben Tennyson never gives up. Like it never happened. Didn't see me coming. Reignited and ready to go. Saving the day? That I can do! Oh, Benjamin. I apologize that I was unable to assist- No! You were right! For once. Look what I found in room 237 at the Long Horse Inn! Ah! I told you. Never doubt the universe. It seems these lines converge at Landlock Castle. That would be an excellent place for this magician to get up to something evil. But what could it be? Oh, I'm getting another message. But it's... it's very fuzzy. I need something to hone my senses. Care to help? A hero's work is never done. I've hid some of my magical totems on nearby islands, in case of fortune-telling emergencies. I bet those will help. I'll be back in a flash with those totems. Here I go! Again! Thank <laughs> you. 
Don't slip up! I'm sliding on in! They don't look too friendly. Baddies up ahead. Save the day like a pro! This can only make me perfecter! Just skating by! Try that again. Ah, yes. These will do nicely. The message is becoming clearer now. He found the crystal. I have to... Here. Take this compass. It will lead... Hey! This is the compass Gwen read about on the tablet. The path is dangerous. Be cautious, Ben. Don't worry. This is Ben Ten you're talking to. Not in. Don't slip up.
Take that! I see monsters!
Too chilly up here in your shorts. Freeze, Hex! Drop that crystal! The only one who will be freezing is you, Ben. got cold feet and wouldn't fight me himself. He must... This'll make me strong. For the crystals. He must be headed for the castle now. Uh-oh. Head back to the campsite and we'll figure something out. We won't let him win, Ben. On my way.
so Hex doesn't scatter all your aliens again. The tablet has one last section that shows some kind of magical shield called the Omniguard. Maybe that could... It sounds like her only hope. The Omniguard is in the Void Realm, but to access it, you need an old book with a strange symbol on... Wait a minute. I've seen that symbol before. Dr. Fibian used a book with that symbol for her beard growth serum. I...
costume? Monsters! Over there! Fully charged. What's that in the distance? Monsters? Yeah!
I'm ready for battle. Yeah! Over there! Ugh! <laughs> 
Take that! Over there! I see monsters! I ran Scissor <laughs> It's time for a rumble! Take that! Should I give him a head start? Take that! Baddies, up ahead! Smooth sailing! Just getting by! I'm sliding on in! Don't slip up! I'm sliding on in!
getting on in. Time to ground some monsters! Let's hope this works! I got the Omniguard! Let's hope it works. The tablet hasn't failed us yet. I'm ready as I'll ever be to face Hex. I bet he's in the castle by now. Good luck, Ben.
insolent boy. Couldn't just enjoy your vacation, could you? You had to... You know what I always say? It's hero time. I won't let you get away with this, you glorified party magician. Ha! Do you not remember how this went last time you challenged me? <laughs> how? Aliens or not, you stand no chance against me! Bend to my will, physical world! Put me in, coach!
ahead. of all four crystals at my fingertips. How can I be defeated by a puny child? Bend to my will, physical world. Who wants a BBQ'd monster for dinner?
This is not the end. I will become the most powerful magician this world has ever seen. And if not, at least I'll be ruining your vacations. <laughs> Actually, I saw all of Strudelbeck and didn't get bored once. This has been a pretty good vacation after all. Are you all right? He won't be giving us any trouble, for a while at least. Nice job, Ben. Hey, I had plenty of help along the way. Think, without Hex, we wouldn't have gotten to see all this beautiful scenery. In fact, this detour gave me time to find ten more stops for the next leg of our trip. All... Ugh. Where to? Ah, peace and quiet. Before we head out, you may want to finish helping the people of Strudelbeck. Defeating Hex seems to have closed off the void, but any remaining magic still needs to be banished. Feel free to keep exploring. Gwen and I are keeping busy trying all the local cuisine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, take all the time you need. 